I'm Miranda Hansen. I teach at Travis Elementary on Travis Air Force Base. I usually try to focus on more on the positives than I do the negatives to help get them understanding what a positive behavior looks like. So I will have um, students, if they are on time, they get the on time award. If they have their homework, they get the homework award. Um, they know the expectations um, better now because they're seeing it. They have immediate feedback. Oh, okay, I was just now being respectful. I know what that looks like. Oh, I was just now being safe. I know what that looks like. So they see what it is the adults on campus and everyone else are looking for. And it really helped me become more of a positive teacher rather than constantly you know, telling the one kid, stop, 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 stop. Instead, now I can give the point to those students who are around him. And when that student who is misbehaving hears the sound, also sees the people getting the points, they're like, hey, wait, you left me out. And they automatically, I mean, they really do. They buy into it. They're like, oh, I didn't get one. I'm going to change my behavior. They compete with each other to be the player of the day. So whoever has the most combined points gets a small certificate that says, I was one of the players of the day, and I put their name and the date. Every single day, rain or shine, it doesn't matter. Who was player of the day? Who was player of the day? I have sixth graders, and the fact that they're still involved in that who was player of the day um, is amazing. 